Hey everyone, welcome back to JavaScript tutorial. In this lecture, we will take a look at second looping statement which is do while loop. Do while loop is just like a while loop but except that the loop expression is attested at the bottom of the loop rather than at the top. We first declare do section and then specify while with expression. It means that the body of the loop is always executed at least once. Using do while loop, we first execute the statement and evaluate expression. JavaScript execute the program from top to bottom. That is why it will first execute the do statement and then evaluate expression. So following is the syntax of do while loop. Do then statement followed by while with expression and after that don't forget to put semicolon just after the closing parenthesis you can put multiple statement in the do block with compound statement using curly braces occasionally you have a certain situation where you need to execute statement at least once at that time do while loop is very helpful so let's take an example of do while loop. So we'll create a variable using let count is equal to zero. Then we start do while loop using do keyword with compound statement. So I will specify curly braces here. And then to print value on the console, we use console.log and put count value string and to concatenate count value we use plus sign and specify count variable here just after that we will increase the count variable value using plus plus sign and then at the bottom we specify while and in the expression we will specify count is less than 5 and specify semicolon at the end. Now in this example, we are printing count value on the console using console.log method. Using concatenation, we concatenate string and count value together. And after that, we increase the count value by 1 using plus plus shorthand operator. And then after the compound statement closed, we will specify while with the expression. In this expression, we will check count value is less than 5 or not. So now let me first execute this statement and show you the output. On the console, you will get count value from 0 to 4. So the do while loop first execute the do block and then move to the while expression then the do while loop evaluate expression and if we get true value then the execution will move at the top and execute do block again so the do while loop do the same thing again and again till the value of expression will become false when the expression returns false then the loop terminated so that is why when the value of count variable become 5, the expression will check that 5 is less than 5 or not. As you know, 5 is not less than 5, 5 is equal to 5. So the expression returns false and the loop will terminate it. Now you will be think this is the same as while loop, isn't it? It is not. Do while loop work like a while loop but there is a one difference in do while loop. As I said, do while loop execute at least once. So if I change this expression and check if count value is less than 0, then what would be the output? Let's see. When you execute this code, you will get count value 0 on the console. So do while loop execute do block first and evaluate expression. So in the expression, we already specified false condition. So the expression will returns false and terminate the loop. 
as simple as that. You can do the complex things in the do while loop with the use of if and else statements. That is upon you how you put different things together. If you are following us from the first part of the JavaScript tutorial series, then it would be very easy to understand all these topics. That is all for this lecture. We will see you in the next tutorial.